Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler, and today we're playing Battletech. So this game was developed by the developers of um, uh, Shadowrun. They are um, I used to play the Shadowrun uh, series, uh, like uh, Shadowrun Hong Kong and um, Shadowrun uh, Returns. Uh, I like the uh, this type of games and. Also, I understand that this game um, is also originally uh, written by Jordan Wiseman, the one of the original creators of Battletech. And if you are not into the Battletech universe, is this um, futuristic um, universe where um, there are several noble houses uh, fighting each other and there is all this uh, civil war. And in this game, you are in charge like of a mercenary company and you are caught between these uh, different uh, noble houses and you're trying like to to make a profit and to survive, <laughs> basically. Uh, so let's get uh, right into it. We are loading in the... We are going to play the, the campaign, continue with the campaign. Um, so basically, uh, Battletech is a um, turn-based uh, strategy game um, where you have you you command several mechas and um, you perform different missions. Uh, but the, but the, there's a, like a background story as well. So um, it's not like um, open world there's a story and the game has several dlcs that you can buy and i think these dlcs they bring more stories or campaigns <clears throat> but we are currently uh, playing the like the the campaign that comes with a with a base game um yeah there are different type of of mechas that you can have you you uh, as as uh, you progress in the game and you complete missions you salvage mechas and you start building the, uh, your own um, team or it's like a, a commando of uh, mechas and they have like different um, skills or depending on the on the weapon uh, loadout that you you build with them they have different skills and you can employ different strategies uh, for the game and um, yeah basically you are um, improving your megas improving uh, your character because also it's the, like a role-playing game where you have uh, the pilots of the mecha they they level up and they improve their skills and and such okay so we start with this uh, ui here and here you can access your ship uh, the command center the barracks in the barracks you you have access to the mech warriors in the mech bay you have access to the uh, mech base um, let's go to the mech base uh, now and see what we have there so as you can see I have um, six mechas here but um, four of them uh, are being maintained currently <clears throat> you have this timeline here where you see uh, how much time uh, it, they need to, to get things done in the barracks you can see the the different pilots you have you can What's level that? them up um, you can spend like uh, say experience points yeah I'm um, currently I have two two pilots uh, that are not available because they sustain injuries and you um, you have like um, Depending on on the skills that each pilot develops, they they have like this um, specialization. Uh, they will perform a, a certain role in the team. For example, here Behemoth is a brawler, then Boss is a gunner, um, Cold Fire is a defender, 
uh, Decker is a scout, uh, Glitch is a lancer, and so on. When when you have someone new in the team that they, they don't have any skills, then they are uh, ranked as recruit, and then you can develop their skills. Uh, here we can we can take contracts. These are the available contracts and um, how difficult they are to to um, succeed. And uh, yeah, but currently the problem is that my uh, mechas are not ready, and they will take some time. So. Um, we can you see here the this is one one of the mechas and if you go to the refit um, UI you will see uh, that you can change here the, the the weapons and you can change uh, the also you have control over how much armor you you place on the on the mecha so this one has the a PPC these are par particle project projector cannon they're quite powerful um, but they're used for range attacks also I have missiles here let's go back and let's go to the low part and here in this uh, button you can um, let the time uh, run and then we will have some mechas Ready I won't over financials whenever you are okay yeah so here you you have uh, uh, this uh, budget uh, you spend money and each um, each month you have to pay the, like the maintaining costs and the salaries and you have to handle this this finance financing thing and here you have several um, modes uh, of the budget if you want to be generous if you uh, want to be restrictive and these have uh, morale um, effects so I go for generous whenever there's enough money and yeah let's keep the the time running because we need at least um, yeah I think that's it Let's see how many mechas do we have. Yeah, so we have four now. Sorry, we have five. Five mechas, and I think this is enough for now. We can go and uh, take a mission in the command center. Let's take a contract. this one is we're looking for a mercenary company to do some uh, covert work for us we've lost a base to the magistracy of canopus and believe local government personnel are being interrogated even now we can't allow these people to spill their secrets but it would look bad if we were seen to destroy our own base we need the deniability we need you to level the base particularly the storage and communication facilities we'd appreciate it if you ensure there were no living witnesses and we'll pay a bonus if you wipe out all uh, the opposition so you see um this is the the the, the missions that you have here is uh, they are um, coming from different uh, factions and these factions will um, they are they are fighting each other and as as you uh, perform these missions you will gain reputation with uh, the faction that is hiring you 
but you will also lose reputation uh, with a faction that um, that's that is being like harmed by by the success of that mission so for example there is this um, um, faction here the magistracy of uh, canopus and we're con currently having some standing with them okay and but this is outside of this system what else do we have uh, well this is um, to to fight some pirates if there are enough pirates there to present to present a problem for local authority we we should be prepared for a tough fight okay let's take this one it's, it doesn't seem so difficult okay and here comes uh, this uh, negotiation UI you can negotiate the payment uh, if you want more payment you will get less salvage for example so let's leave it like that let's go again against the pirates yeah let's let's do this okay so uh, the mission is ready we have to destroy the pirate facility structures and escape so let's do this Commander, our target is just ahead. You need to knock down enough structures to cripple the facility. Watch for fixed gun emplacement and enemy defenders. These pirates have nothing to lose, so they'll be desperate. Okay. There may be additional enemy units deployed away from the base, so keep your eyes open. Oliveira out. Okay. Okay, y'all. Stay frosty. So there are different type of movements you you can just move or you can sprint or you can jump with the with the jetpack and moving uh, will give you evasive actions uh, and you will have plus two difficulty to hit um, this unit with uh, range attacks if you sprint then um, You have plus two to hit this unit with range attacks per evasive charge. So yeah, sprinting um, gets you um, farther away, but I think with move you don't have so much st uh, stability. Your mechas can fall, by the way. They can just um, lose stability and just fall down. So, and uh, depending where you move, you you can get some advantages from the terrain in this case i'm moving the mecha to these uh, trees here to this forest and um, yeah this give me some cover and i can already see uh, some turrets so we need to take those turrets down let's see uh, if I jump, I cannot get. Oh, jumping doesn't give me um, special. Position confirmed. I think I will. I will not reach. I won't reach. Uh, ah, now I have them inside. Maybe I can shoot them glitch could shoot these turrets with a no they are out of sight okay they they are out of sight but maybe glitch can have um hmm, i cannot you see here that it tells me if uh, moving currently i cannot i cannot have um a view of the target so I cannot shoot it 
and even if I move here I won't have this uh, the view but still I will move my mecha because I need to go Work forward let's see I don't know if they can see me by the way they cannot see me because they are not I hear you and look cold fire can shoot at it it seems yeah Tell me what to shoot. This is the PPC, by the way, what is shooting. Seem not to do much damage. Ah, there's a vehicle incoming. Those those vehicles are aye, aye. relatively um, easy to to shoot. So, sh Razorback can also shoot. Let's shoot the turret. Oh. There we go. Confirm. Okay, now the structure is exposed. So it shouldn't be um standing by. Ah, uh, she cannot from here, yes. Behemoth can shoot as well. She has a medium laser. And some missiles as well. And an an auto cannon. So you see here when I'm <coughs> here's the turret, right? They have uh, the the white points are the armor points, and the and the orange points are like these structure points. Once a, a, a mecha or any uh, structure uh, runs out of structure points, is destroyed. So currently, it has two uh, structure points remaining. And here, as you can see, that I'm preparing to f to fire. You can see that I will uh, shoot my auto cannons and uh, long range missiles. They are yeah, they are yellow here. Target acquired. I mean, that's that's all. That turret is gone. Yep, it's gone. I Indeed. hear ya. Okay, now we go for the second. If I want to shoot down that second turret, I have to move here. But that in that position, I won't be able to. Uh, I think there's no, yeah. No, I think the only. I will have to do uh -huh. this. I'm not covered here, but there's no other way I can get this turret. So I will attack with the PPC and long range missiles. Fire. Well, that attack was effective. The structure is exposed. The vehicles are coming. But I can take care of them. The, the vehicles are easy to destroy. I think. Okay, they shot at me some missiles. Another. Another round. Is that it? I'm barely hot damn, let's do this. <laughs> okay. I'll wait here for now. Okay, you can reserve the movement. 
Now they are coming. Okay, it's my turn now. Let's move uh, the Vindicator because I'm a little bit exposed here. Mm. And I will fire at this vehicle. PPC and long range All missiles. No, oh, that is destroyed. I told you this. <laughs> these vehicles, they don't. I feel bad about shooting the little guys. <laughs> yeah, she feels bad to shoot at the little guys. Um, <clears throat> one thing you can do with the mechas is that you can step on vehicles. This is really a <laughs> a mean move. By. But it's kind of funny, and I see, I can see that I, I cannot um, shoot. What Let me see you? if I can shoot with coal fire. No coal. F ah, here. Coal fire can have an uh, a defensive stance. Who else? Nobody can take down this turret unless. Yeah, it's too far away. Behemoth could do that. Yes, Racer back. Uh, she has medium laser and short range missiles. Let's uh, use that one. The Centurion. Okay, because that, that turret is... Yeah, with the auto cannon. That's it. One less turret. One less. Okay, so... Let's continue with the Behemoth. Yes. On my way. And coal fire. What can he do? Where is he now? Here. Ah, I have to finish her move, but she cannot attack anyone. I can. Uh, uh, so we we have these options. We can brace. So remove unsteady and end this mega turn. Gain guarded 40% damage reduction against range attacks to the front and side and entrench. The other thing is vi vigilance, gain garden and entrench and remove all stability damage. Your next initiative is increased by one. Okay, let's let's do that. And brace. Let's see what Waiting coal you, fire can do. He cannot do much, it seems. And if I jump, sometimes jumping gives you an ad like access to positions that give you certain advantage. But I see here no advantage whatsoever. Okay, I will just move him closer. No sweat. And I will adopt again this vigilant stance and wait for the enemy to come after me. Here comes the ve vehicle. Yeah. Here it comes. And another one. Yeah, I took very little damage because I was entrenched. 
60 damage reduction. Yeah, this is a good strategy. Light damage, Commander. So I'm basically I'm letting them uh, come closer. I hear you. Let's see. Can I jump farther away? Oh, that's It doesn't give me any advantage. But I'm in their range. This is the, the thing. I'm in their range. Where should I move? None of this position have, has any advantage whatsoever. But I need to take them down because they can see me and I cannot see them. Ah, like I could just move to this place to see if I can get a better chance from here. Commander. And again, I cannot. Uh, I can go here. Let's go there. There we go. We're entrenched. Commander. And of course, this. Um Moving out. As long as I'm in trench, I will not receive uh, damage, or at least a lot of damage. Where is glitch? Glitch is here. Ah, she has. Ah, that's great. She has. Um, she will. Uh, she can shoot uh, long-range missiles to the vehicle, and look at this. Since we have a rock in between, we cannot shoot the the, the cannon, the the particle cannon, but we can shoot long-range missiles. So we will do that, and hopefully. Oh, they didn't practically damage the the vehicle. This is strange. Okay, but at least it's moving. Hopefully we will have him in range. Another vehicle. It seems they only have vehicles. Waiting for orders. Yes, I need to get closer. Can I jump? No. Ah, but look, I could jump here and have access. Well, this will give me access to several targets. I think I will do that. Jumping. And the first thing I will destroy is this guy here. It will lose. It will shoot uh, this target with a uh, medium laser, auto cannon, short range missiles, and large range missiles. All that. Wow, but this one is really sturdy, this this uh, striker. Waiting on you, Commander. Let's see, uh, he can shoot. What is he able to shoot from here? Just the structures. Let's see, can you jump? Somewhere closer. I could jump here and I leap, I 
try to take that vehicle. I don't know why it's so sturdy, really. You will shoot with a PPC. Roger that. Firing on target. Okay, did some damage. Awaiting orders. Okay, she can attack from there. With the auto cannon. Affirmative. And glitch. Waiting on you, Commander. Glitch can do it as well. Ah, she, but she cannot. Oh, that's not good. Got it. She needs to move a little bit. She will attack with a particle cannon and a long range this missile. Come on, people, let's make it happen. Wow, the you vehicle. Like the vehicle was destroyed, okay? That's good. Finally. Here comes another one. He's in range. Barely hit, yeah, but I don't like that position there very much. What can I do for you? Let's see. I think you can shoot someone for me. This one with the PPC, far at him. Uh -huh. Did some damage there. What's up, boss? Yeah, you have to move from there. Yes, and basically move here. Heading out. Warning. Enemy reinforcements detected. As I suspected, Commander, we've picked up additional pirate forces closing in your position. Oh, this is not good. This cannot be good. But she will Let's see how you like this. This one is sturdy. Well, from here, I don't have access to that one. I want to have... Okay. I think I will shoot the, just the... The turret. Oh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, it's not such a good option because she will shoot only like um, only the the auto cannon. She has medium lasers, short range missiles, and a machine gun. So she's good at close range. So I have to get her closer. I think I will come here. On the move. I need to destroy that thing. Yeah, now with the auto cannon, the short range missiles and the laser. Yeah, shoot at him. He's a goner. Reporting vehicle destroyed. Okay. So who else is waiting for orders? There's glitch. Glitch, can you shoot? Yeah, shoot at the turn. It's almost destroyed this turret. Oh, very bad aim. Okay, but still I have to take this 
vehicle out of here. Mm. Very bad aim. Not a single shot. Oh. Oh, one of my pilot got Light injured. Damage. Holding firm. One of my pilots got injured. Waiting on you, Commander. I hate that. Okay, are you able to shoot that turret down? No Once and for all. What are you doing? Stand still while I'm attacking you. <laughs> Man, what did he do? I don't know. Is the enemy stone? Okay, guys, we need to get that turret out of the way. And yes, my centurion has to do something here. I will get closer to the vehicle so I can shoot with all what I have. Firing on target. Orders. Yes, I need you to shoot down the turret. Yeah, the turret won't give me any more problems. One left turret. Okay, so I have what can I do for you? still one vehicle here. Shoot it down. Firing everything I've got. Yeah. Good. So I've got rid of all the vehicles, but they have reinforcement somewhere. It could be even that they have a mecha. Let's go here. We have to destroy the the, the buildings. But we need to get closer. What does he have? The PPC. Yes. If it's PPC. Affirmative. Ah, he didn't reach. Hey, stay in the crosshairs. <laughs> I think I hit some tree. Ah, you see? There's a mecha. Mm. I knew it. And another mecha, two mechas. So let's see. Commander. Where where can I go? Uh, it would be good if I can go closer. Yes. Somewhere here. This is a good position. We'll and to let them come closer. Ready for orders. There's beam off. Okay. If I jump. If I jump I can have access to that mecha there. And then everybody can shoot at Firing jump jet. Let's have a precision strike so you guys see what 
what we will do with this precision strike. We can try to hit at uh, its legs so it will fall down. Let's see what happens. Uh, I couldn't get him down. Waiting on you, Commander. Let's see what she can do. You betcha. Let's have another precision strike at the other leg. Uh -huh. So if I can just destroy his leg, he won't be able to move. No retreat. That's what I'm talking about. What can I do for you? So let's see. What can he do? I think it's time for him to move. Where can he move? If he jumps, ah, look at this. This is a good position here. But hmm, it's good and it's not so good. Okay. Here we go. It's not so good. Ah, yeah. He he can he children themselves. All weapons are go. No, he's taking a really hard beating right there. The Shadow Hawk. Okay, let's see what we can do with um, Razorback. Maybe no, cannot move any further. I can shoot at that mecha, but I want to inflict more damage on this one. Hmm. Okay, well, for now it is what it is. And with this one, no, I need to get closer. I need to get closer. Yes. On my way. Let's go Double there. Time. These are short range um, mecha. Is that another mecha? Yes, Commander. I oh, know that's a vehicle. Yes, I will try again to destroy his leg. Roger that. Glitch. What is Glitch doing? Glitch, what are you doing? Ah, Glitch, you should... Ah, but I don't need to jump for that. I can just walk there. On my way. You should walk. And hit that guy. With uh, long range missiles. And another striker. Taking minimal damage.
Let's see, these are Jenner. Ouch. Damage minimal. Okay, I need I to you. finish off this guy. Let's see. Let's make the precision strike. Wow, his legs are destroyed. Take this. Good. Where is Razor back? Hi, nice. ah, she's going to attack with everything. We'll okay, the taking a critical hit. Yes, that was a critical hit. I destroyed some weapons. I don't know how this Jenner is walking. I destroy both his legs. I can't take much more of this. Waiting for orders. On it. Reporting critical hit. I hear ya. Okay, I will try to move her closer. And I have to take the centurion off there. From here, well, from here I have access to all the targets, I think. Ah, but here only the... Okay. From here only the... The long-range missiles. I need to have... Yeah, I will move here. I need to have a clear sight to shoot her with a... To shoot this Jenner with a PPC. Yeah, there. Ah, he's losing stability. Down he goes. Ah, the pilot died. So that when the mecha fell, the pilot uh, was incapacitated. Hang on there, razor back. Hang on there. Waiting on you, commander. Oops. No. They're blowing through my armor. Yes, I will take you out of there, Razorback. Commander. Can you jump? Where can you jump? No, or sprint? Yes, sprint here. So you don't take so much damage. So let's see, Glitch. What can you do? Oh, this is a good position. Don't need to tell me twice. Yes. Yes, the vehicle is destroyed. Yeah, she should um, 
Let's see. No, she will have to jump. Yes. Roger that. So she's not so exposed in that rock. And now I can shoot at him. Fire with everything. Huh. Ooh, he's falling. He's falling. Yes. <laughs> Pilot injured. Come on, people, let's make it happen. Let's make it happen. That's what, what I can I do for you? That's what I say. Make it happen. Now, um cold shot. Wow, his leg was destroyed. When I shoot you, you'll take it and like it. <laughs> you'll take it and like it. Wow. Okay. He missed. So, where is Razorback? Razorback, you can shoot at him, right? Yes. Give him some. The pilot is incapacitated. <laughs> okay, so, um, uh, there's another vehicle still. You missed. Okay. Receiving you. Let's see what I can do with this guy. Only long range missiles I can shoot from here. Let's fire these Affirm. missiles. See what. Oh, he took a beating. And Waiting glitch. You, glitch. Let's see, Glitch, if you can shoot your cannon at this vehicle. Yes, with the PPC and the long range missiles. He's destroyed. Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> okay, so what is uh, pending here? On you, Commander. What can you shoot? Ah, uh, the l the turret. He can no, he cannot shoot at the turret yet. But we should take down that turret. Can you jump? Ah, if he jumps here, he Time to fly. he will be able to take the turret. Yes, with the PPC. Yup. That's what I was talking about. And the Hemoth. I think you can take the turret as well. No. So you have to walk a little bit. And shoot at this guy. Wow, with everything. With everything. Yeah, the turret's destroyed. That turret is gone. Yep. Standing by. Okay, now we can. I think we can just um, focus on the structures. Military building. I don't know which one. I think we have to destroy everything. Yes, with the auto cannon. Affirmative. I'm reading heavy damage to an enemy structure. Bring it down. Yep. That's what we are doing. do 
for you. I want just to destroy this one first. Special delivery. That's the PPC. Structure down. That's one of them. Aye, aye. Yeah, now that the rem the reminder of this um, mission is just to destroy the structures, I think. I can get this Centurion as close as I can because it has also a machine gun. Let's destroy this one. Copy that. Good to go. Locking on target. Everything. And glitch. Glitch can just. Roger that. Firing on target. That's it. Target destroyed. That's it. Who's next? I hear you. With a PPC. Got it. And the machine gun. I will bring him closer. Copy that. The machine gun is a really um, short range uh, weapon. Target locked. I think we, we haven't used the machine gun yet. Command. It's usually... Uh, fire at really close range it um, sometimes uh, when you make a melee attack with a, a mecha that has a machine gun then the machine gun is used in combination with a with a melee attack Okay, well done. You managed to wipe the OP4 out. I can do an extract right now. No need to get to our plan LZ. Mission successful. So that was it. That's the end of the mission. But one, one pilot got injured. That's a bad thing and also we sustained some damage so these mechas that that had um, their armor damage or they had the especially the ones with internal damage they have to go to the repair and and they will um they will um, remain there for some days also as you can see here the the faction reputation um has varied with we decrease our reputation with a local pirate organization, of course. Um, the planetary government, I don't see m much change here. So, destroy pirate facility, structures and escape. Destroy pirate garrison, success. Hidden objective, destroy base turret, success. Destroy pirate reinforcement, success. So, that's it. We earn our payment. Well done, Commander. We obviously place our faith in the right mercenary company. We'll let you know if we have any other work for you. Great. So, wow, the Centurion got one leg really damaged. This will be under repair. And Behemoth got uh, injured. So she won't be available. She won't be available for the next mission. She has to go to some um, medical treatment. We have some general locust. They would 
give us some more things. These are the things uh, where we were negotiating that you can receive some some salvage. We could select two salvages and and then they give us extra salvage. I um, got some Jenner parts and Locust parts. Uh, you can see here that you have we have like this count two of three. When we complete uh, the number of parts, uh, we can build a, a new mecha with them. Uh, but at any given time, you have a limited amount of mechas. So I think for me, there are some, I think some six mechas. That's the maximum. And the rest, the rest of mechas, they are like stored in, in somewhere in the ship. They're not available. And if I want to use some stored mecha available, then uh, it, it's not immediate. Like they have to get it ready. But I have to make space for it. So I would, in my case, I would have to store one mecha to bring another one. Okay, guys. But I think um, we leave it here. Um, is If um, turn base. Uh, games are your thing and if you like uh, this battle tech um, universe and, and yeah this type of um, RPG games then you you should try it out I, I like the game uh, I like this type of games and yeah it's um, I think it's it's uh, still under development. They are still updating the game, and I think the also the, there are some uh, these DLCs that you can you can buy separately with. Um, I think there are other campaigns. Okay, guys. So hope to see you in the next video. This is Cyber Settler signing off.